So let's take a start. Well, uh, in reading module, the question type which we're going to discuss that is yes, no, not given. Okay, yes, no, not given. This is what we are going to discuss and I'm going to give you some tips. Why uh, am I calling you my personal IELTS coach? Because I'm going to give you some tips and I'm going to be with you. Like I'll take you by finger and I'll walk along with you so that you could not feel any problem or you don't face any problem in IELTS reading. Okay, let's see the questions. Uh, I'll show you the questions first. The question type is yes, no, not given. And the question is the destruction of land for food and firewood is linked to desertification. Now remember one thing, whenever there is true, false, not given or yes, no, not given. Over here in the statement, you have to underline some clue words, right? Sometimes the clue words will be very, very clear. Sometimes they will use the similar words in the passage. So clue words will help you reach the portion where the answer is going to be now let's see the destruction of land for food and firewood now underline food firewood they might use some other word but you need to keep in mind food and firewood is linked to desertification if because of food and firewood they are chopping down the trees that means it's leading towards desertification if they are mentioning this thing then it is true if they say that's not the reason, then it is false. And if they don't mention this very phenomena, then it is not given. So let's scan food and firewood. I've done this test already. So that's why I know where the answer is. Let's just go there. Now you can see that as well. It's written here, uh, food and firewood. Yes, I, f I found it. I I'm going to read from here. Green fields are turned into airports. Virgin forest is stripped. Now mind this, virgin forest is strip. Strip means desertification or deforestation we also call it. Uh, is stripped to provide food and firewood. That's right. To provide food and firewood actually they are chopping down the trees and what are they doing? They are stripping the forests. So that's why this statement the destruction of land for food and firewood is linked to desertification or desertification that is yes clear okay let's go ahead we do question number 10 shortage of space has also led to underground building construction now shortage of space underground building construction you got to keep in mind the word shortage of space scarce space and underground building construction that is what we call basement it can be basement or something like that so let's see where the answer is now the clue word here is underground basement underground basement underground okay right so you got to scan for that and when you scan for underground you can find it there i'm going to show it to you it's written here there has also been a tradition for building underground now you got to see shortage of space has also led to underground building construction is it yes or no or not given and here the examiner is checking your ability to understand writers views or claims i repeat in yes no not given they check your ability to understand writers views or claims so here he says there has also been a tradition for building underground not just for transport systems but for the storage of waste uh, depositors for books so what is it here they say shortage of space has also led to underground building construction. Yes, there has also been a tradition of building underground, not just for transport system and all that stuff. So this is going to be yes, because the writer has mentioned that there is a tradition of building underground. And if you look at the beginning of the paragraph, there you will understand that they are talking about... Uh, uh, shortage of space so this whole paragraph this whole passage is about shortage of space so question number 10 is yes number 11 the building of the airport in Japan cost much now the clue word is Japan and airport now you got to see whether the building of the airport in Japan cost much more than that of the housing complex in Dubai is it yes no not given that building an airport in Japan cost much more than that of housing complex in Dubai. Now you got to just look for three words, Dubai, Japan, and uh, airport, okay? 
yes i found it i'm gonna show it to you okay it's there uh, it's written in japan kansai international airport has been built offshore on a man-made island at vast expense and in dubai a very imaginative and expensive housing complex in the shape of a palm tree is being built just off the coast of land they've mentioned two separate things one is airport in japan and second is a housing complex in dubai but they don't say anything which cost more which cost less that is why it's not given clear okay let's go ahead number 12 arthur c clark was the only person to predict that mankind will inhabit other parts of the solar system now the clue word is arthur c clark and you got to see whether this statement is given by only arthur c clark and there were some other people or there were some other people as well who said the same thing now let's let's look for arthur c clark okay yes i found it okay i'm gonna show it to you yes here arthur c clark a fervent supporter of savage now argues that by the year 2057 there will be humans on the moon mars europa uh, ganymede titan and in orbit around venus neptune and pluto Feynman dyson favors the kuiper belt as the future home of humanity now we've got arthur c clark at the same time there is another guy who said something relevant to that so that is why it is no the statement is arthur c clark was the only person whenever they use the word the only it means there are certain doubts about that so there is another guy who said the same thing that is why it is no now we do the last one the last one is the concept of the habitation of outer space by mankind is unimaginable the statement is the concept of habitation of outer space by mankind is unimaginable means we can't even imagine that now you got to see habitation space outer space planets and all that and if you want to find the answer i found this word habitation you need to scan for the word habitation i found it in paragraph e please watch carefully habitation in outer space so obvious habitation in outer space in huge stations is no longer just a dream no longer just a dream means the concept of habitation of outer space by mankind is unimaginable no it is imaginable that's why this statement is going to be no